Even though so many small businesses are closed these days, a bakery in Greensboro is celebrating 10 years of creating custom cakes and delicious desserts for the community. But a sweet success bakery has a much bigger mission. Fox 8 foodie Shannon Smith joins us with more on their story. Shannon. Good morning, Brad. Yes, we want to let you know that we did shoot this story before the stay at home orders. And we want to let you also know that this place is special, not only because it has those delicious cakes and cookies you were talking about that I was able to taste, but because of the bakers, they're extraordinary. They're using their time in the kitchen to help overcome struggles with mental illness. A sweet success bakery sells hundreds of beautifully decorated cakes and other decadent desserts every month. We make cakes, cookies, cupcakes, of course, um, different bars. I like cookie dough better than cookie. Me too, me too. But the bakers, like Emma Peoples, are the real success here. Baking has been wonderful for me because it helps me calm down and it helps me focus on something else. Doctors first diagnosed Emma with severe depression and anxiety when she was 13. After years of struggling to find her long-term path, a therapist recommended the Sanctuary House. The mission of Sanctuary House is to help support adults with serious and persistent mental illness, and that is by ways of getting back into the community in a very meaningful way. The bakery is one of six work programs offered by the nonprofit organization. Here, clients like Emma receive one-on-one -on -one training from the bakery's manager, Jennifer Forsyth. Well, there's just a lot of stigmas that they're, they're different or, you know, you can't work with them. Um, but they're just like anyone else. They have a lot to offer. And Emma's proof. After training at Sweet Success, Emma enrolled in culinary school and graduated. And Emma's done fantastically. She actually lives on her own now. She's been able to move into her own housing and take care of her own basic needs. But she still returns to the bakery often to volunteer. Because I really believe in getting the word out there and educating people about mental illness. And that's the other part of the bakery's success. Since it opened 10 years ago, these cookies and cakes have become super popular in the community. And it immediately spearheads this dialogue about, wow, you got this from the bakery, and what's the bakery, and who did it? And it creates the story. And sometimes a cupcake opens dialogue about mental illness. Emma says while the baking brings her peace, she hopes her creations help the community understand others like her. We are all, all just like everyone else. We're just trying to make it through life, and we're just trying, we've got a few extra challenges. And make it a little sweeter along and the way. And make it a little sweeter along the way, that's right. Back out here live, you can see some of the creations that bakers have been making since the quarantine went into place, the little toilet paper roll cupcake there, some pride in North Carolina cookies, and a party for one cake. If you'd like to help out this wonderful cause, you can order these. Custom order it. Go to their Facebook page, A Sweet Success, or you can also give them a call. They're doing curbside pickup to keep everyone safe out here on the lawn on this gorgeous day. They are open from 8 to 4 daily for you to come pick up those things. And Brad, they're super easy to find, too, right across from the baseball stadium in downtown Greensboro. And what a great way to give yourself a little treat and help out people in our community. So, Shannon, in the story there, it looked like you were sampling a few things. Got anything you'd recommend out of all the treats on the menu there? They have these pecan pie bars that I thought were phenomenal. They were so good, and their cakes are delicious. They are professional looking, wonderfully priced, and you're helping out to fund programs over at the Sanctuary House. So. Maybe if you like one of those pecan pie bars, maybe custom order one of those. Those sound delish, wonderful. Shannon, thanks very much, and a neat yeah. place to go help other people.